Alright, let's look for this. Oh wow, where we're by night, 33. First pair of the moon night. What's up comic book fans, comic book addicts, welcome back to another epic comic book haul. So let's go ahead and get started as episode number 183. By the time we reach 200, I just might do a giveaway. So these are the clearance comics that I got from my high price books. Sometimes you have to just search through the clearance section. And I'm definitely a big fan of Street Fighter. I used to grow up playing Street Fighter and Mortal Kombat and I prefer Street Fighter. So yeah, I was one of those guys. <laughs> Street Fighter and Necro and Effie. Another Street Fighter, Akuma vs. Hell. Street Fighter, Manette. I'm not sure who that is. Kind of like Gypsum character. And here's a special one. Look at this. Dynamic Forces Street Fighter number 0 variant. And features a certificate of authenticity. Certificate number 1485. There are going 2,000 copies. So definitely limited edition. 25 cents. Are you kidding me? Alright, so I cleaned this up real good. These were all clearance items. TIE Fighter number one, which features the uh, first team appearance of Shadow Wing and Eureka Quell. Sonic the Hedgehog. I'm pretty excited to watch the uh, upcoming Sonic 2 movie with Jim Carrey. I like the first one. It did really good at the box office. So that's issue number 254, one of his later issues. Doctor Strange number one. And this features the first appearance of Zelma, Staten, and Imperator. So, these are Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles number one. is Happy Halloween Special Edition. And yes, these are 25 cents each. So I got three of those. Let me give you a look and see what is it all about. See that? Yeah. Halloween Special See, dating back to 2012 and his first printing too. Ooh wee. Never seen these before. Transformers number five. I cleaned out real good. Early issue Transformers. Must have in a collection. Transformers number six, and that's a new stand edition. That features the first appearance of Josie Beller. Uh, later becomes a circuit breaker who is a villain. Dark Horse Comics number seven. This is the first appearance of Nomi and Wilma Sunrider. Two important characters in the Star Wars uh, universe. Darth Vader number 14. Uh, first appearance of Verla. And <laughs> I don't really collect um, Archie's comic, but when Cheryl Blossom number one does a premiere issue, why not? Considering it's half of that, so it's like 75 cents. Why not, right? Avengers Arena number one. This is pretty hot because first features first appearance of a whole bunch of characters. Dev Lockett, Kit Brighton, uh, Cool and Bloodstone, and Necronism, and Nera, and also Apex. So similar to Young Avengers, a whole bunch of uh, first appearances. Oh wow, incredible, oh, gorgeous, super rare. I don't see this one too often. This is the first time I ever see this comic out in the wild. This is the uh, hard to find Incredible Hulk vs. Superman. Another crossover between Marvel and DC. It's a trade paperback size. I love it. I've been wanting this for, this is like a mini gem right here. This is Avengers number 12 featuring uh, Iron Man wields the Infinity God. You remember in the end game when Iron Man wielded it? I think that's when he gave up his life. Yeah. So that's a definitely important issue. How awesome is that? Avengers, this is symbol number 503, Death of Agatha Hardness. Spider-Man number 13, uh, classic McFarlane cover and pose. Another must-have. And this one, I think I, hmm, I think I paid a cover, half of cover of that. It's not 25 cents. So 50 cents for that. Amazing Spider-Man number three thirds. Or I might have paid a, yeah, I think it's something like that. Um, so this features the 
uh, first four appearances of Sinister Six, all those characters right there, Sinister Six, they kind of pretty much appeared in uh, Spider-Man No Way Home. And, of course, Young Avengers number one, the first team appearance of the new Young Avengers, so all those characters that you see right here, Hulk Link, uh, America Chavez, um, Kid Loki, and uh, Kate Barton. Kamikaze number one, this is a preview of Speed Racer. And here is Speed Racer number one. Oh, by the way, I, uh, these are 50 cents or 40 cents each. I think I grabbed 25 of these. So these are, yeah, yeah, 40 cents each. So we have Ninjak. This is the 4CG variant. This is called the Four Color Gradient Variant. Are much harder to find. See how they use four colors to, to, to color this uh, cover. Here we have Empress number one. I think that's the regular cover, and here is the variant cover. Mark Millar from Millar Verse. I really love these glow in the dark comics. So that's Superman one twenty three glow in the dark, uh, featuring the uh, first, uh, you know, first costume his electric blue costume and fail save this was trending up uh some time ago is acquired by netflix so the story goes like this the man goes up against nanotech enhanced super soldiers so that seems like a pretty exciting story right there these early edition dark horse um, comics uh, star wars 40 cents why not it's going to be a good read too. So I picked up some of these comic blocks. Special edition. See it's already wrapped. Shrink wrapped in this original. Dutch Dread. Daredevil versus Punisher. Another cool cover. You know. I love these uh, fights. Warlock number one. That's a special Quesada. Joe Quesada cover. Variant cover. And here's a Deathlock number one. Also I think that's. It doesn't say Joe Quesada. But it's a special variant cover. Pretty badass right there. That kind of reminds me of early 2000s. J2 number 8. This is the um, first appearance of Saberclaw. Hudson, Logan, Wolverine, Sun in the MC2 universe. Just a Pilgrim. This is the WizardWorld.com exclusive. So Garth Ennis Limited Preview Edition. Here is a Marvel Knights from Wizard Comics. This is trending up, guys. Shot up the value to like $12 or so because this features the first partial cover of the cover appearance and sketch preview of Yaina Belova, you know, the new Black Widow. If you guys have seen, uh, by the way, I just finished watching Hawkeye. It was pretty good, but nothing compared to, to um, Book of Boba Fett. That's a lot better. <laughs> And I actually also like Peacemaker better because it's so funny. Green Lantern number one. Gotta have that. And Exterminators number one. This features the first team appearance of the Exterminators. Okay, once again, we have, uh, looks like another Superman. <laughs> Glow in the dark. That's the regular first printing. And here is the second printing, which is harder to find. That is the Ron France... Variant cover, and of course, the debut of the blue electric suits. Hulk number 466. This is the first time I've ever seen this cover. Death of Betty Ross by radiation poison. Later resurrected as Red She Hulk. So, if you guys are the one that want to hunt for comics that, you know, before it trends up in value, we know the Red She Hulk is going to be hot. So, if this is the first resurrection, should shoot up in value just a matter of time peter parker number eight this features a blade is bitten by the morbius turning him into a daywalker so it's an important issue to have and here's number four that is the the first appearance of hunger avengers number four i think this is the second volume first appearance of warbird formerly miss marvel uh Played by Carol Danvers. Avengers number 8. First appearance of Triathlon. Even says on the cover. Step aside, heroes. Triathlon is coming through. So I guess another one of those speedsters. Exiles number 1. 
this features the first team appearance of the Exiles, first appearance of Morph, and the first full appearance of Nocturne. So it's a very important issue. There's Morph and there's Nocturne. I think Nocturne is the daughter of Nightcrawler. X-Men Adventures number one, first appearance of Morph from the animation, okay? Spider-Man City at War variant edition number one. It's uh, the, based on the video game from the PlayStation video game. Batman Sword of Azrael book number one. This is the first appearance of Azrael. So back in the 90s, Batman broke his back. And that's when Azrael took the helm of Batman. So that's who he is. So that's a little comic history for you guys. Quicksilver Secret. <gasps> Silver Star and your sixth first appearance on Legacy. Margot Kale, I think. Wow. Still probably back. Oh, yeah. I was looking for this for a minute. Silver Surfer annual number six. <laughs> Most of the time, you don't want these annuals. But this one is uh, special because it features the first appearance of Legacy, son of Captain Marvel and Elysius. That's Legacy right there. I don't know much about the character. It kind of looks like Quasar a little bit. Captain Marvel number Captain America number eighteen, first appearance of Primax. Harkness. Again, Avengers 503, Death of Agatha and Harkness. West Coast Avengers. <gasps> Oh yeah, I just couldn't believe my eyes when I saw this sitting out, man. Are you kidding me? For 40 cents? Who? Avengers West Coast. West Coast Avengers 61 and 62. These are important issues, guys. Origin of Immortus. Scarlet Witch revealed to be a Nexus being. First full of team appearance of the Timekeepers. Yes, sir. Must-haves. Mortal Kombat! <sighs> I couldn't believe it, guys. <laughs> I think I paid $3 for this. I was just searching through his variant, this kind of shop's variant editions, and this was in there. I was like, oh, snap. I've been wanting this for quite a while. Mortal Kombat Kung Lao, number one, featuring the origin of Kung Lao. Kidding me, man? Dragon. Oh, what's this right here? Oh, that's one of those low print ones. Oh, the last rounder. Look at this. The printing is this. Oh, snap. First printing. Wow. <sighs> Finally have this in my collection. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, The Last Ronin, IDW, issue number one. Even though it's quite expensive, at $8.99 for cover price, but I got it from Half Price Books, so half of that. So you imagine $4.50. I think I had a coupon too, I'm not sure. First appearance of your Oroku Hinto, Grandson of Shredder, and the first appearance of um, Casey Mary Jones. Yes, sir. Beautiful. That's going in my MVP collection, no doubt. All right, half bar spells. Let's look through these comics. Star Wars, Poe Dameron, Come on, Big Night, Doctor Aphra, Darth Vader. Oh my goodness! First appearance of Doctor Aphra. It was the rare second red pen printed too. Wow. Cartoon. 
perfect price, maybe. And lastly, I saved the best for last. So whenever you watch my combo hauls, make sure you stay tuned for the whole video. Kabam. This looks a little bit different, right? Because the first printing is in kind of like a purple bluish hem. Why wow, this is the harder lower print. Star Wars Darth Vader number three. Second printing featuring the first appearance of Dr. Aphra. First appearance of Triple Zero and BT1. Couldn't believe it when I saw that, man. Just sitting out there. I always dig thoroughly. And the comic gods were with me that day. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Whenever I am thirsty, I take a sip of the coldest water because it keeps my favorite drinks the coldest. Happy hunting.